Hello, my alien students. Welcome back. Uh, yeah. So today, um, I would like to ask you one simple question. Okay. This question, I'd like you to answer in the comment section. Okay. And then I'll explain in the next class. I explain how to do it. You know, I like, give you the concept behind it. Okay. My question is is as follows. And this is the way I like to teach. Okay. Ask you the question you think, and then I give you the answer. Isn't it? Okay. The question is as follows. Okay. Two questions there will be. Where's my beautiful pen? One minute. Okay. The question is as follows. Okay. What's the difference between a link CAD and import CAD? Okay. That's the first question. Okay. I hope it's clear. Question number one. Question number one, what's the difference between link CAD and import CAD? Okay, if that's good. Okay, question number two, you know, in AutoCAD, we do have layers and layers in the sense we have line weight also, isn't it? Each object we put uh, assign a line weight. Okay, if you don't understand what's a line weight, I just open one drawing and I'd ask you that question. Just a second. So we're back to the story. Yeah, so we are in AutoCAD now. So let's suppose we go to the layer properties manager. Okay, click this. Okay, you see the line weight here. Yeah, yeah, one minute. Yes, this is line weight. Okay, each object has a different, each, let's say, each layer has a different line weight. Okay, so when you insert it in rivet, okay, I've inserted here in rivet. Okay, actually, this is one is I've linked it, link a CAD, and the second thing is uh, import CAD. Now my question is how do I know let's suppose I send you this file okay I send you this file let's say uh, level 1 is link CAD and level 2 is import CAD. Now my question is how do you know which I have done how do you know have I linked it or have I imported and I send you this file I saved it and I send it to you okay my question is how do you know it okay first thing I need to select it so I'll select pin elements okay this is import CAD. Okay. My question is how do, how do you know? How do you catch? Okay, John, this is hundred percent import CAD. Okay. Another one is yeah. Select pinned elements. Okay. My question is <coughs> sorry. <coughs> so how do you know this is imported or is this imported? Okay. In the comment section let me know okay and i'll tell you how to do it in part two i'll teach you how to do how do you know when you get a file like this how do you know if it's imported or linked okay and what's the difference between that's question number one question number one what's the difference between a link cad and import cad okay second thing is once i get the file let's say it's somebody send me the file how do i know is was it imported or was it linked okay the third thing is okay you see here there are different different line weights i hope it is visible just a second minute can you see it no can you not see it okay let's see here can you see it One minute. yes now you can see it, isn't it see that they're different different some are thick and some are thin okay my question is okay this is for baby aliens isn't it line the line weight okay good Okay, now here there is default. Okay, default layer zero element is in uh, default wall thickness, not wall. Sorry, line weight. Okay. In rivet, how do you change the line weight for the um, layer zero elements? How do you know which is in layer zero? <coughs> Select the uh, link file. Go to query. <coughs> sorry. Okay, you can do keep doing one by one or go to VG, imported CAD, go to layer zero. Okay. Okay, I would not have done this, but okay, anyway. Elements in layer zero. Just change the color to red so you would see it if it is there. Nothing in layer zero. <laughs> okay, there's nothing in layer zero then. Sorry okay sorry then okay my question is suppose you have an item which is in uh, layer zero let's not with the default 
line weight okay how do I change it in Revit okay here it's default I want let's say to change it to something else some other wall thickness how do I change it think and give me your answer in uh, the comment section okay I think this class would be let's say I'll be making always two classes not anymore moving forward one would be the question and the next class would be the the answer the solution okay so I look forward to receive your answers the question is as follows first question is what's the difference between link and import okay now second question if I have a file let's say to a file inserted already or linked here okay how do I know is this link or imported both look same okay how do I know is this imported or is this linked okay third thing uh, the about the line weight okay default is given I want to change the default uh, thickness in Revit to something else. How do I change it? Okay. In the next part, I teach you how to do it. Okay. Take care, and we see each other in the next class. I'll be looking. I look forward to receive your solutions or your comments. Okay. Take care, and uh, I think that's it for today. Okay. We see each other in part two of the class. Yeah. Bye.